Hey everyone, welcome back to the Run Lead Gen YouTube channel, where we help businesses like yours grow and thrive online. I'm Brian, I have over 20 years experience in digital marketing, web development, and SEO. Today we're tackling a very important topic, what to do if your Google business profile has been suspended and your appeal gets denied. If this has happened to you, don't panic. We've got your back. Stick around, we're gonna walk you through exactly what you need to do to get your profile reinstated. Let's dive in. First, let's talk about why your Google business profile might have been suspended. Google is pretty strict when it comes to their guidelines and even small mistakes can lead to a suspension. Common reasons include violating Google's guidelines like keyword stuffing in your business name, having duplicate listings, maybe using a virtual office instead of your real address, or even suspicious activity on your profile from you, an unscrupulous marketer, or even just not knowing what you've done goes against the guidelines. If you've already appealed that suspension and it was denied, it can feel like a dead end. There's nowhere to go. But here's the thing, there is still hope. Google has a special form specifically for cases where the appeal was denied. This form is your secret weapon to getting your profile reinstated. I'll leave a link to it down in the description below. So make sure to check that out after this video. Now, before you fill out that form, there are a few things you need to do to increase your chances of success of getting your profile back. The first is to review Google's guidelines. Go through your profile guidelines with a fine tooth comb and compare your profile to make sure you have everything all buttoned up. We've seen all types of reasons why people have made small mistakes or big mistakes that go outside of Google's guidelines. So once you've made sure every single rule is followed, if you find any violations, fix them immediately. That's the easy part. The next part is gathering evidence. You'll need to prove to Google that your business is legitimate. This includes photos of your business, uh, copy of your business license. They really like a utility bill with your business address on it. Any documentation that shows your business is real and compliant with the guidelines. Step three, write a clear and concise professional appeal. You've only got about a thousand characters to get the job done, but explain why you believe the suspension was a mistake and then provide all the evidence that you've gathered. The more professional and detailed you are, the better your chances. Now, Here's a pro tip, you have to be patient. The reinstatement process can take time and Google might ask for additional information. Stay persistent and don't give up. If you're feeling overwhelmed or you just wanna make sure everything is done right, that's where we come in. At Run Lead Gen, we specialize in helping businesses like yours navigate these tricky situations. We've successfully reinstated dozens of Google business profiles and we'd love to help you too. Ready to get your Google business profile back up and running? Click the link in the description to access the special form for a denied appeal review process. And if you need expert help, don't hesitate to reach out to us at Run Lead Gen. We're here to make sure your business gets the visibility it needs and deserves. So thanks for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on our tips, tricks, and everything that we're doing to help businesses like yours grow. We'll see you next time.